My name is Kelly Sanford. I'm a junior and my major is entrepreneurship and family business. I want to own my own performing arts school. I want to definitely kind of like go all over the U.S. with it. I definitely realize that if I want to really do something that I love, something that's creative, I definitely want to own my own business doing it. I actually had a resume consultation with Jan Mopper and it was actually very enlightening. She actually showed me stuff that I could improve on. She showed me stuff that could be integrated with something else, like my work, I had been promoted. She was like, well, you don't have to keep listing certain stuff, you could change this, you could add this. And then she also made it sound more professional instead of like amateurish, because my resume was definitely not what I expected it to be at the end. I was like, wow, I sound so much better on paper now. <laughs> So I got an RA position with Auburn Global. I move in in the middle of December and then I start maybe like a week later. By the time I had gotten to Auburn Global, it had been a couple weeks since I've done my um, resume consultation. I sent that in. I even created a cover letter. They asked for a cover letter, so I sent a cover letter in. Once the application closed, I got, an, I got a notification about an interview. They wanted to set up an interview maybe a week after the application had closed. And I was like, I'm really excited. Like, I didn't even think that I'd get this far. So I like pulled out all the works. I went up there, I had my resume, I had my cover letter. It was really interesting. She got to know me, she got to know my strengths, she got to know my weaknesses, and it was just enlightening. A mock interview, I advise that because a lot of people like get really nervous and get really shaky and it's like, it's really just, you don't need to be laid back, but just be calm, be collected, talk to the person like they're a regular person, be more professional, but still you don't want to show that you're too nervous. You just have to kind of make peace with yourself and be like, if it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, it doesn't, but I definitely want to put my best foot forward. So that process really did help me realize that it's okay to fail, but it's okay to succeed as well.